Good, good, good morning. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, I'm sorry. Anyway, hey, good morning, everybody. My name is Mr. Scheidler. I am your host. Uh, today is Thursday. It's April 30th. The year is 2020. I know you don't believe anything I'm saying. It is April 30th, 2020. Our word of the week continues to be the word diversity. Uh, again, diversity means uh, understanding that each individual is unique uh, and recognizing our individual differences. Uh, again, diversity is a good thing. Uh, if we were all the same, if we all said the same things, if we all thought the same things. So I appreciate diversity in looking at different things, and I hope you do as well. Let's begin our day with the Oracle mission. I will be innovative, be bold, build a legacy. Uh, a couple of things as I was driving into school this morning. Oh, just I still, I still first, you know, there's nobody around me. I still can't park my car between the lines, and I don't know why. I have a small car. Uh, I chuckle. I take pride in myself when I can actually park my little car between my assigned lines. Nobody around, and I can't park my car. Kids, I don't think, maybe you can write out your parents. If they can't park between the lines, let me know. Also, surprisingly, I like the Keurig coffee maker in the office. Um, yeah, I do. I don't know what that means. So, anyway. Um, I miss my people. My people are the kids, the parents, the teachers, our support staff. Again, I do see some of you. I got to see several kids over the last couple of days. I participated in a few birthday uh, drive-bys uh, when asked and my schedule allows it. Um, you know, I've got a couple of neighbors that are my our students. I miss them, but I get to see them from afar. Um you know, occasionally I'll see somebody maybe at the grocery. Um, don't hesitate to say, hi. Hey, I do miss you. I'm thinking about doing something so I can see uh, anyone who can get out and wants to see me. Maybe uh, I can sit in the chair at the front doors and uh, we can shoot. Uh, yeah, you know what I mean. Anyway, with that being said, a um, couple of birthdays. Uh, looks like um, our good friend, hey, Charlie Foss, not happy birthday to you, Charlie. Also, Lionel Hernandez, happy birthday to you. And uh, they're special, the two of them. I want to give a special shout out to my daughter, Kalina. Uh, believe it or not, she is 19 today. So uh, I just find that hard to believe. And I'm glad I turned the next page uh, because we do have another birthday, Rylan Rush. So happy birthday to Rylan and Lionel and Charlie from our elementary school and Kleina, a graduate of the elementary school. Also, because I'm trying to be on top of things, I want to give a shout out to uh, Mrs. Cree. She has a birthday. So happy birthday to you, Mrs. Cree. I <clears throat> uh, also want to give a shout out to uh, Kenley Roth. Uh, Kenley, I'm looking forward to seeing that work that you're about to turn in. I know you've got some things to get done, but I've heard how smart you are and what a great reader you are. So make sure when that stuff gets turned in, uh, you add a note so I can take a peek at that. Okay, Ken Lee Roth. Um, let's see. I want to give, um, again, another shout out to everyone working so hard. I know you're working hard. Uh, trust me. I know it. I feel it. I hear it. Uh, these are harder days for sure by definition. Um, one advantage I have that I didn't used to have is I don't, I don't have kids at home. Still working long days, don't get me wrong. So kudos to all of you that are working to bring this income in. You're teaching. Um, I thank you to my teachers who are teaching and teaching. Um, so, again, we're all in this together. And again, I would continue to say, if you need anything, please reach out to the teacher first, if possible. But feel free to call the school or email me. All that information can be found on our website at de.delphi.k12. Dot in dot us. Uh, for today in history, uh, today in history on April 30th, uh, this day in 1803, United States, the United States made one of its best investments ever. Uh, France sold the Louisiana and adjoining lands to the United States as part of the Louisiana Purchase. So we were just an infant. We were a toddler. We were just young and we bought this massive piece of land that double the size of our small country at the time. Uh, that was called the Louisiana Purchase. Interesting, interesting information. And just a few years later, 1912, Louisiana, the state, became the 18th state in the United States. 
Also, I think it's interesting that on this date in 1939, again, we talk about media, you know, radio, satellite, cable, TV, online TV. I know we use an antenna to get some of our channels like out of off yet. Um, that made its official debut in 1939. So again, that, that, you know, I know we like to think that's forever ago and I know that's before my time still, but you know, a lot of this stuff is still new. So it's still kind of interesting. In 1975, when I was just a wee little boy, four years old, the Vietnam war ended when South Vietnam surrendered to North Vietnam. So again, we've had a lot of war. Um, again, we need some peace. That's for sure. So anyway, I believe, and I've got, I, I don't want to turn too abruptly because I don't want to be taken out of my underwater safari. So with that being said, after today's announcements, please have a moment of silence and uh, follow the Pledge of Allegiance. If you have not done your monthly fire drill um, by state law, you have to do your monthly fire drill if you are a school. So it might be a good thing to talk about. Have your fire drill. Uh, talk about where to go. It's always a great thing. It's never too late. Uh, remember to live the Oracle mission. Um, today's episode brought to you again by Ajax, Stronger Than Dirt. Have a great day, everybody. I'm never sure how to, to stop this. Okay.